we have finally made it. I don't think I've ever been happier to like finally be somewhere in my life. So we just sat down at this restaurant called Hog Island Oyster Company. And here comes Ryan, he comes back from the bathroom. Um, so we just sat down at this place called Hog Island Oyster Company and we're gonna eat oysters and we're just for a say. And the view here is so pretty. It's right on the water. Look at that bread. So, okay, just to finish my little intro for this video. So we are spending the day in San Francisco and then we are going on to our Airbnb, which is outside of Napa. Um, and then we're gonna be doing wineries and everything. We're gonna be capturing this whole week, taking you guys along with us. Hopefully if you guys are planning on visiting there soon, I'll give you guys some recommendations. And without further ado, if you haven't already, please subscribe. I'd love for you to stick around and watch more of my videos. And let's get this week started. Hey guys, so we just finished eating and we ate at Hog Island Oyster, which is about two miles from Fisherman's Wharf, but whenever we looked up, me and Ryan both love seafood and especially oysters and neither one of our families really liked it, so it's kind of becoming our thing. So we ate at this really awesome place, which you guys just saw, and we were driving around, but we're kind of tired because we've been just traveling all day, and so I think we're gonna, we're starting to head towards our Airbnb, which is in Casadero, California, closer to Napa than San Francisco, we think. I'll keep you guys posted. I might, I don't know if I sound totally wrong right now. Um, but before we head out of town, we're gonna go to Battery Spencer, which is what I, when we were looking up best spots to see the Golden Gate Bridge, this was like near the top of all of those lists. So we're gonna go there and just, enjoy the sunset obviously take some pictures and then continue on our way oh my gosh this view is so cool hold on taking some pictures at the Golden Gate Bridge and it was so beautiful. We were right there, right at Golden Hour and it was just perfect. Battery Spencer is the best place to go. So right now we're headed to our Airbnb in Casadero and we are in need of some more coffee. Um, and I'm a huge Emma Chamberlain fan, I just love her. And we found a Phil's coffee along the way and that's her favorite coffee shop that she always goes to in all of her videos on YouTube. And so I cannot wait to do a review and see how this coffee is that she always raves about. I think she gets an almond milk latte. Um, I need to text my sister before I get there to make sure I'm doing this correctly because I need to get her order. <laughs> and I'll let y'all know how it is. We got the goods. And the verdict is in. So... Ryan ended up getting, or okay, so I ended up getting Emma's order, which is a large dancing water with almond milk, unsweetened, and she just makes it sound so delicious that whenever I tasted it, I was like, this is literally just black coffee, and I didn't like it that much, but then Ryan ordered, what is this called? The rosé. It's literally called the rosé, and it has like rose petals in it, and it's, it's like, Sweetened. He ordered the girliest drink on the menu. He ordered the girliest drink on the menu. <laughs> and he tried mine and he was like, oh, I love this. And I tried his and was like, oh, I love this. And so we switched. So the verdict is, I'm sure for anyone that loves black coffee, Emma's coffee is lovely. I thought it was great. Brian loves it. So that's, that's all we got. Good morning, you guys. It is Tuesday morning. And okay, so we got into this Airbnb like so late last night. We couldn't see anything around us. It was a miracle we even found this place. And we woke up in an actual tree house. It is the coolest Airbnb. I'm gonna give you guys a quick tour right now. So you walk in the door and there's stairs up here and our room up is up there where we slept. Um, you can see we've obviously made ourselves at home over here with all of our stuff. And then this is the living room. And then, oh my gosh, can you see that view out there with all the trees? We're in Casadero, California. And then you step down, we got the TV. I just think these chairs are so cool. I really want this one. And then we have a little sitting area, kitchen table, fridge, kitchen, 
pantry in there, nothing too interesting in there, I wanna show you all that. Then this is the coolest thing I've ever seen. Everything's locked. You walk outside, and they're just the tallest trees you've ever seen. It's so cool. You know we're about to get some good picks out here. <laughs> and then you walk back over here. This fire is so cozy. And go up the stairs. And this is where the sink is. And then I just like hung some clothes and a towel over here. Nice bathroom. Toilet. And then y'all, this whole thing is the shower. I could not believe my eyes. Turn on the light. Look at this shower. I love. I let it steam up last night and it was like I was just taking a shower in a steam room. It was so awesome. Okay. That is that. And lastly, oh, so cool. Um, here is where we slept, our bed. And then up here is this really cute little reading nook. So, yeah, that's the grand tour. I don't think I showed you guys our cute car. How fitting is this for our day? We are about to go hiking. And then see where the day takes us. Hey guys, quick update. We are just driving along the coast. Um, we had a super casual day, so we went hiking in the redwoods like you guys saw a little bit ago, and then we just like stopped and got a quick bite to eat and had the best like crab sandwich ever, which being from Texas, you know, we have like fake crab I feel like most of the time. So right now we're just having a super casual day, like no makeup, sweats just enjoying being on vacation together. And then um, tonight we're gonna go to dinner for Ryan's birthday at this nice restaurant in Jenner, which is a little town on the coast. So we're gonna do that and head back here in a little bit and like we rest for like a little bit and then get ready and then have a fun rest of the day. But it's so beautiful here. We're so happy to be here. Hey you guys, so it's been a little bit. Um, I just took a much needed little snooze and we came home from hiking and um, seeing all the things. And I'm doing my makeup because we're about to go to dinner for Ryan's birthday. His birthday is not until Thursday, but the restaurant we wanted to go to really isn't open on Wednesday or Thursday. So here we are. But I'm doing my makeup and I'm not going to like do a whole makeup routine. But I want to show you guys this new concealer I got. This is the Hourglass Veil something. I don't know. I've been hearing people talk about it a lot and I went and picked it up and it just does the job people are saying it's even better than tart shape tart i can't talk tart shape tape and i honestly kind of believe them because i just use that too and this one like a little goes a long way so i'm gonna shut up and i'll just show you guys what it looks like but let me see what i can do this with one hand i didn't bring a tripod for my camera okay so i'm literally just gonna do like that much Here, a little on my pimple. Okay. And I'm just gonna take this like fluffy brush and blend it out. The lady, I had a lady like demonstrate on me or, or like sample some on me at, the, at Sephora, and she was so right. A little does go a long way. So 
super bright to me. We are ready and out of the house. So we're going to dinner right now. It's called Rivers End in Jenner, which is like the cute town on the coast. I don't know if I've said that yet. Um, and there is not a full length mirror at this place. And so it's kind of hard to show you guys my outfit, but let me show you guys the gist. So I have this like leather trench on this silky camisole that kind of like dips a little bit. My Madewell necklace, don't mind. I have this like dry patch on my neck, you guys. It's not a hickey. <laughs> um, and then my purse is my Fendi these really cool jeans. I will also show you guys whenever we get there and then my outfit and then I also have these like really cute little slides from Zara. Hope that. birthday to you. Hi birthday to you. Hi birthday to Ryan. Hi birthday to you. <laughs> Yay! We got the goods up in here. Lucky charms. And the flakes. This is our first time making like regular coffee in so long. <laughs> this is the closet. I like this oven. It's very sleek. Yeah. The detail. It is day three or I guess two and a half, it's Wednesday. And so we just got up and got ready and we have brunch out in Yauntville, which is really close to Napa at Restoration Hardware, which I don't know if a lot of people know, but a lot of people don't. So Restoration Hardware is obviously a furniture store, but they also have restaurants. And this place looked so cool. I've never been to one of their restaurants and so we have a reservation there for brunch. And then from there, we have a winery tour at Mum Napa at two, which is, they're known mostly for like their bubbles and champagne. And so I'm really excited about that. A lot of people have recommended that to me. Um, and then after that at 4.30, we have a tour at Sterling Vineyards, which I found that one, or no, my friend Jessie recommended that one to me. And that one's gonna be cool because you go up on a tram into like a mountain is kind of what it made it seem like. So we have that at 4.30 and so that's gonna be our full day. And I'll take you guys along with me and I'm really excited. And then I'll show you guys my outfit when we get to the restaurant because I'm all bundled up in a coat right now, but it's really cute. That is gorgeous. There she is <laughs> in her natural habitat. Yum. You having a good time, babe? I am. <laughs> it's a lot of wine. Ah, uh, could be more. <laughs> Brut, Brut Reserve Rosé, Santana. And we got some crackers. And a gorgeous veal. Okay. 
crazy. <laughs> She goes pretty high. Wow. Ooh. That's kind of high. You scared? <laughs> Should I shake it? Oh my god, no. <laughs> no. You doing okay? Yeah, I think so. <laughs> it's. You know, if we fell, I think we'd live. That's kind of what I think. We'd only about. break like most of our limbs. <laughs> Yeah, I like when you record. Oh, so while we're here, I changed outfits. This is my top from Storettes. My legging pants are from Pretty Little Thing. And my shoes are from Topshop. With our sparkling rosé. This is going to be 65% Chardonnay grape and 35% Pinot Noir. So this is the 2017 Vignette. Okay. Are you guys familiar with that one? No, I'm not. No? Okay, so not a lot of people are. And that's all right. We're all here to learn, right? Yeah. I'm True. Here. Yeah. This one to me is... Siri, what's the address of the dad's house in Parent Trap? I'm looking at it now. <laughs> oh, it's closed. Why is it closed? It closes at 3 p.m. Mm. <laughs> Y'all, the wine is getting to me because we just got a cheese board and we are now at Gott's Roadside, which I think is like a fast food chain here. And I am about to demolish a burger and cheese fries, but went on vacation, you know? And I'm just really happy to be here. My friend Kimberlyn told me to come here and it's so cool. It's like an in and out, but you can get beer and wine, but we were literally just at a winery and so, and we're about to drive back. So I don't think we're gonna get a wine or anything like that, but. Let me show you guys, it's so cute. It's just like this along, it's called God's Roadside and it's just on a, on a roadside, you know? Reminds me of like an Andy's custard. You guys have this. Oh my gosh, this looks so good. That's my burger because I'm a fatty. That's Ryan's shake because he's a fatty. <laughs> and I do have ranch dressing, so apparently ranch on the side of this not is a Texas thing, so that's great to know. So it's Thursday now. It's Thursday. We're getting close to evening. It's like four o'clock. And um, we just had a pretty chill today. Chill day. Today is Ryan's actual birthday. And so we went hiking and got some seafood. And I've just had like the best chill, most Ryan day ever. So we're about to go take some pictures because we want we have a really cute rental Jeep and we want to go park it like by the beach and get some cool shots. And then we're gonna go get a drink at the same place we had dinner the first night. And then we're gonna find somewhere to have dinner. Um, and yeah, just enjoy our last night. Tomorrow we leave, but we're gonna spend the day in San Francisco before our flight later on in the afternoon. So that's the move. And then let me show you guys my outfit. I'm wearing this really cute set from Zara. So it's like a cardigan, but then it has like a little bralette underneath it. Bralettes, um, I've been seeing a lot of, or like a really big trend right now. And then I just have my wide leg jeans and my um, Air Force Ones. Good morning, guys. It is our last day, or I guess we're leaving today, so I don't know if that's our last day or if yesterday was, but we are all packed up and ready to go. We Our flight's not until 4, and it's like super early still. It's like 8. Um, and we are about to get on the road and go to San Francisco, where we're flying out and just spend 
a little more time there. I think we're ready to get back to a city. I think we've been remote long enough. I think we're definitely city people at heart. So, but we've enjoyed this vacation so much. It's been like so perfect and relaxing. I couldn't have thought of anything better for us to do. Um, but yeah, so once again, I will show you guys what we are doing today. And then my outfit is, I'm just wearing this New York baseball cap. It's really cute because it has like a flag on the side. I've never seen that. And then this sweater from Aritzia, this bodysuit from Zara, this necklace. Gosh, I still thought that my neck. And then um, sweatpants from Forever 21 and Air Force Ones. Last day, best day. Got my eating pants on. <laughs> We're just psychopaths drinking wine on a Friday at 11 o'clock. I'm trying to go to Tony's Pizza, but they don't open till 12. We're just trying to do all we can do before we leave. But that's the move. Oh my gosh. Do they have a knife? We should cut them in half. Hey guys, we just got to the airport. I just wanted to go ahead and sign off on this vlog. Thank you guys so much for watching. We just got to the airport, numbing the pain that vacay is over, but spritz season is just beginning. Cheesy, whatever. Okay, thank you guys so much for watching. If you haven't already, I'd love if you would subscribe to my channel. Give this video a thumbs up if you want to see more like this, because obviously I want to travel more too. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.